Kunywa and Assembly Majority Leader Joseph Kiguru, the MCAs embarked on a fact-finding mission to address negligence, allegations that have caused an outrage amongst the residents of Laikipia. Now earlier, a section of Nanyuki residents held a peaceful demonstration at the Nanyuki Teaching and Referrals Hospital main gate, decrying what they say is the provision of poor health services at the hospital. <laughs> kulikuwa kwa laboratory tulitukiwa hapo tunangoja tulikaa sana sijui ni nini ilikuwa ndani venye walikawia like uh, one and a half hour tukiwa tu tunangojea tukaona wametoka watu wengi sana kwa hiyo laboratory wakubwa wakubwa madaktari manases tukaona wametoka huko so hatukuelewa kwamba ni nini kilikuwa kinaendelea na huku mgonjwa wetu akawa hali mahututi anahitaji kushukurikiwa kwa haraka mtu amekufa tu hapa tukiangalia hakuna leadership hakuna mtu hata governor anasimama ni uchungu sana juu niliona mama mtoto akitoka nurses wanaangalia tu na mtoto mtoto alikufa alitoka na akakufa unaweza sikia aje umelea mtoto for nine months na mama yake ukiingia hapo unatoka bila mtoto utasikia aje wewe kama binadamu hata wale watu wako hapa ndani tutakuambia hata yeye kesho ataenda hospitali nyingine na hatalipa tu Kabisa. management ya hospitali hii ya Nanyuki very poor ni kwa sababu e, zile shida tumepata e, unakuta ya kwamba hata wauguzi wako na uoga wa kitupea ujumbe ambaye tulikuwa tukitaka so there is a lot of intimidation e, kwa staffs wetu Elsewhere, protests have been witnessed in Mumias after angry residents received the news that Devki Group of companies that was allowed to revive Mumias Sugar Company on a budget of 5 billion shillings has pulled out of the deal of a political interference. Through Devki Chairman Narendra Raval, Devki will only accept the offer if it will be an open process. Now, residents are now pointing fingers. Um, to local leaders who they accuse